In a significant boost to Ukraine's naval capabilities, the Ukrainian Ministry of Defense, MOD, released footage on October 12, 2024, showing the deployment of the Combat Boat 90, CB-90, assault craft by Ukraine's military intelligence HUR. This new addition marks a critical step in enhancing the country's maritime defense capabilities, with the boats being integrated into the Viking Maritime Center, an elite unit of military intelligence personnel who have undergone specialized training in Sweden. The CB-90 boats, affectionately named Drakers after the legendary Viking longships, are designed to perform a wide range of missions, including amphibious operations, surveillance, patrol, and providing fire support on water. These high-speed, armored vessels are equipped with powerful weapon stations, including machine guns and automatic grenade launchers, making them formidable assets for coastal defense. Notably, the vessels are also capable of carrying light anti-ship missiles, naval mines, or depth charges for anti-naval operations. One of the standout features of the CB-90 craft is their versatility. With a capacity to transport up to 21 fully equipped troops or 4.5 tons of cargo, these boats can support a range of military operations. They are ideal for transporting personnel and supplies in coastal or shallow waters, especially in situations where traditional ground transportation might be hindered. This makes them a vital resource in maintaining Ukrainian forces' mobility and logistical support particularly in hard-to-reach areas where conventional routes are compromised. Powered by two 600 kilowatts diesel engines and equipped with water jet propulsion systems, the CB-90 is capable of reaching speeds up to 45 kilometers per hour, allowing for swift maneuvers even in challenging coastal conditions. The boat's armor protection shields it from bullets and shrapnel, offering a significant level of safety for personnel aboard while allowing the vessel to operate in hostile environments. With an operational range of up to 300 nautical miles, 550 kilometers, these boats have the endurance to cover substantial distances and perform their duties in a variety of scenarios. Whether it's patrolling strategic coastal zones or laying mines, to disrupt enemy naval operations, the CB-90 offers flexibility and firepower in one package. The deployment of these combat boats has major strategic implications for Ukraine, particularly in terms of coastal defense and counteracting Russian naval superiority. With their formidable firepower and missile capabilities, the CB-90s are well positioned to defend key coastal areas against naval threats, including enemy ships and submarines. Their role in providing direct fire support to Ukrainian forces engaged in ground operations near the water further enhances their importance in Ukraine's defense strategy. In addition to their offensive capabilities, the logistical flexibility of the CB-90 boats allows them to swiftly transport troops and materials across water, maintaining the sustainment of Ukrainian forces in areas that are otherwise difficult to access. This ability to move personnel and equipment across waterborne routes strengthens Ukraine's overall military posture, ensuring rapid deployment where it's needed most. These CB-90 units were delivered to Ukraine in June 2024 after being purchased for military intelligence by the Ukrainian company Medinvest, with several more units expected to be delivered by the Dutch government in the near future. The Ukrainian military will continue to strengthen its maritime capabilities. The addition of more CB-90 boats will further expand the scope of operations that Ukraine can conduct along its coastal regions, enhancing its ability to defend against threats and maintain control of its vital maritime borders. In conclusion, the deployment of the CB-90 assault craft marks a new era for Ukraine's coastal defense and amphibious operations. With their firepower, speed, and logistical capabilities, these boats offer a powerful tool for Ukraine's military forces, reinforcing both defensive and offensive operations in key maritime and coastal regions. As additional units are deployed, Ukraine's coastal defenses will become increasingly robust, securing vital territorial waters against adversaries and ensuring continued operational flexibility in the face of evolving threats.